Over 20 years, I gained a significant amount of weight. It wasn't doing my health any good at all. So I decided that I needed to do something about it. So I joined Slimming World and found that going to group helped me and I started walking more. And then it got to a point where I felt that I was able to start running. So I was on my own, I went to the local park and I ran around there in the dark because I was too embarrassed for anybody to see me. I started with a program called the Couch to 5K. I think it was you run for 60 seconds and then you walk for three minutes. And you repeat this and gradually get to the point where you can run for 30 minutes. And the idea is that you can do 5K in 30 minutes. And then once I'd done the 5K, I wanted to go faster. I wanted to go longer. So I started the Couch to 5K in the April, and then in the July, I wanted to do something to raise money for cancer research. As part of that, I said I would run every day for a year. Um, my wife said, yeah, I think you can do that. The reason I ran every day was I had a picture in my mind of me finishing a race with my father and my brother. My brother had cancer. He's clear now. He's great. He's, he's, he's all clear. Um, but I had a picture in my mind and the last race I did was a park run, a local park run and I finished that and I crossed the finish line with my dad and my brother and that was incredible. I've kind of been the person where I haven't particularly felt good about myself but when I'm running it's me and I'm setting the challenges and I've surprised myself. Mental health has definitely improved. Running for me has been great for anxiety, for stress. Certainly during this lockdown, I haven't stopped working since March. And it has been a stressful time. And just being able to go out and spend some time with me, just running, it's a great stress reliever. So yeah, I've definitely benefited. And obviously the weight as well. Uh, it helps keep the weight off because I'm going out running miles. I don't think running has made me lose weight. I think running has helped me with my weight. Certainly when I started, it was part of my weight loss. I decided to start losing weight and this was part of it. And I lost 10 stone. So I've been able to do far more because I've been able to keep the weight off. I've run the London, which was 26.2 miles. I'd been building up to that. So uh, I'd done half marathons and uh, some five and 10K races. I stood on the start line and I've seen it on television for 20 years and thought I'd love to do that. So to actually be there, and I'll be honest, I, I cried like a baby for the first, first mile, thinking I can't believe I'm doing this. But to actually achieve it, um, unfortunately, the time I've got on it was, I wanted five hours, it's five hours, six minutes, so I've got to do it again. But to actually achieve it and say, I did this, I achieved this, and yeah, that's, that's probably up there as, as one of the best moments of my life. Would I recommend running? I think it's, running's not for everybody. And we're blessed here with some fantastic areas that I can go and run. And so sometimes running on a canal at seven o'clock on a Sunday morning and you see people and you're waving to them. It's just so nice and so peaceful. And certainly for your mental health, it's definitely made a difference to me. It's made me more of a confident person. It's really helped me. So I say running's not for everybody. If you can, give it a go and try it. But for, I definitely say, get out and do some exercise, especially at the moment, it's so easy to sit down and do nothing. Uh, and just wonder about what the future holds. But a lot of the future is still in your hands. You've still got your body, look after it and get out there and, and try something.